You're right, guys. Hope you're all well. So I've uh, just got in, uh, and I've just obviously watched the uh, the Leeds game on the highlights. So Huddersfield won, Leeds won. Uh, for me, not a very good game. Um, a pretty poor performance on what we have done in previous games. Um, you know, I, it's just I don't know why we've um you know we, we we performed like that knowing what we you know knowing what we can achieve uh with you know turning uh teams over but you know you can't expect a run to go on forever so you know luckily obviously it wasn't a, it wasn't a loss which was great uh but yeah for me you know it was it wasn't a very very good performance um you know like i say i know we can do a hell of a lot better um do i think that we Went into this game thinking that we can roll uh, roll over uh, Huddersfield. Yes, I think we can. Uh, I think we did. Um, after you know, after the, the the performances that we've had, the wins that we've had, nine uh, on the bounce. Um, yeah, I, I genuinely thought that we went into this game thinking that we could get a hell of a lot out of it. In all fairness, I'll hold my hands up. I genuinely thought we we could get a lot out of it. Um, I. I Thought it would have been at least a three 0 win. Um, so how wrong was I? <laughs> but I hold my hands up. You know I do apologise. But yeah, we you know we need to stop actually going into games thinking we can roll teams. We can get maximum points out of them. You know, teams now are gonna start think. You know they're gonna start um, putting a hell of a lot of pressure on us, like what Huddersfield have done today. And I'm not going to be the old cliche where they came in hard, they do it, you know, they the tackled hard, they did this, they did that, did the other. You know, it's it's football, it's the game, you know what I mean? If you can't put a tackle in and, and expect to, you know, to, um, to, you know, to accept that tackle, then, you know, shouldn't be in the game. But... You know, I do think obviously some of the some of the fouls were a little bit naughty, if not a lot naughty. Um, now obviously Hogg got that yellow card, and well deserved. And you know, he, he, you know, he can't keep he can't go into a to a tackle like that and not expect a yellow card. Um, you know, it is what it is. It's just one of them things. And then obviously, uh, forty five minutes plus uh, the the score, the the um, the break, the deadlock. So. You know, for Huddersfield, that's going to be, you know, that would have been a, a massive uh, inspiration for them. Obviously, knowing where they are in the league, uh, you know, if they can beat at least a, a top, you know, like a top two, top three side. Um, but then, obviously, you know, the, the hog again being absolutely stupid, he was. You know, flailing his arms in the air, elbow to um, I believe it was Furpo. You know, you're on a yellow card at the minute, so you're not actually. You know, me personally, I know when I used to play, uh, I played either defence or goal. But I mean, either way, I wouldn't throw my arms in the air knowing that I was on a yellow card and you know uh, get sent off. But obviously, he's a professional. You know, you think he would know a hell of a lot better than that, but. You know, he did that. Elbowed Furpo, got the red, got the red card. He's there, you know, looking at the ref as if as oh, well, why are you, why are you sending me off, kind of thing. You know, me personally, you, you know, you've just elbowed a play, you muppet. You know, you're gonna be going. You're on a yellow as it is. But yeah, obviously going into the going into the break, um, Huddersfield one nil up and uh, a man down. Now you thought obviously we would have um, capitalised on on that man down. Um, us having that extra that extra man, but you know it wasn't to be. We, you know, Connor Roberts came on. You know, absolute fantastic player he is. I've you know I've got a lot of praises for Roberts. He's done really well since coming in. Um, you know, he's 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 taken taken the team like a duck to water. To be fair, put the ball in. Um, Bamford obviously on the end of it scored our our equaliser to make it one all, and. I thought obviously we 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 generally could have won the game at the you know at, at the end, but um, Somerville hitting the post and just wasn't our day. So it ended up obviously one uh, one one. Um, definitely points dropped for me, uh, but also we you know we didn't come out and um, be our usual selves. So. You know, it's it's one of them things. We you know we we re cock, we realign, we go again, and 
hopefully we can um, uh, get a win on Tuesday or Wednesday, I believe. Um, so it's, it's a midweek game, but yeah, we we need to we need to start putting a lot of pressure on uh, Ipswich now because obviously Ipswich has won. Uh, they're second in the league now, so they're two points uh, ahead of us. So we need to, you know, put a bit of pressure on them uh, and make them make them worry. But you know, it's one of them things. It's two point uh, two points dropped. Uh, but you know, is it a point gained? You know, at least we haven't lost, which is a good thing. You know, we're still technically unbeaten in 2024. So yeah, onwards and upwards, and uh, see how we can uh, do for the next. Uh, 11 games but yeah guys thank you for listening to me waffle on uh it's been much appreciated if you're new to the channel if you wouldn't mind liking subscribing commenting all the uh all the jazz you know it helps myself helps the channel more the channel than myself um you know it would be much much appreciated uh again my confidence is growing massively day by day if, you know I, I keep getting told that through uh through everybody so um you know it, it does mean a lot but yeah, guys, if you're new, please subscribe uh, and, you know, we can get them, get them numbers up. Uh, it'd be much, much appreciated. But guys, thank you so much. Thank you for listening. And I will catch you in my next video. Uh, hopefully I should be going on uh, live tonight as well with Jess. So we'll, um, we'll have to wait and see because uh, I've, I've been up since half one this morning. But guys, thank you so much for listening. I will catch you in a bit. Cheers, guys. Bye bye.